Now, from your weather authority, meteorologist Joe Bird. Oh, how are we looking in the rocking jukebox? Get that jukebox going. Drop that quarter in. Let that vinyl come on up and let it show us how things are going today when it comes to what we have in the record books. Let's check out those rocking records and see how they're doing. Check it out. Back in 1929, we hit a high of 70 degrees in Evansville. That's good right there. I will take that any day of the year this time of year. However, I will not take that 15 below that we had back in 1994. That was a chilly one right there. Now, I mean, a record rainfall is not a lot, to be quite honest. It's just under an inch and a half there back in 1949. And even though it is chilly and even though it is the winter season and time for the snow, we actually do not have any record snowfall here in the Evansville area to show you. So I am not complaining about that. Don't get me wrong there. I am not complaining about that. Love to watch the stuff fall. And I'd let it melt as soon as it fell. That is for sure right there. Heads Construction Tower camera, everything looking good there on the Highway 41 strip. Kind of a blurry one, but hey, we can, at least we can see it, right? 33 degrees right now in uh, the uh, Henderson Airport. That's where we're picking up that temperature reading for right now. But let me show you here. It's going to be getting chilly tonight. So let's just go ahead and go to midnight. Check it out. 25 degrees under a partly cloudy sky. Still windy. Winds from the west northwest at 16. Overnight here at 3 o'clock in the morning down to 22 degrees. Let's check out 6 o'clock in the morning. Roughly about 20 degrees. So lows tonight are going to be in the upper teens. Factor in those winds, though, they're going to continue on. We're going to have wind chills in the single digits overnight tonight. And through tomorrow and tomorrow night into Monday morning. So luckily... Monday, of course, is a holiday, celebrating a great holiday, Martin Luther King Day. And I tell you what, I'm glad the kids don't have to be out the school bus on that uh, Monday morning because it's going to be a cold one for sure. 31 degrees right now. The current temperature at the Evansville Airport was still a breezy westerly wind here at 12 miles per hour. So some are at freezing, some are below it, some are above it. So here we are right now, kind of a mixture right now. Right at freezing at Carmite at 32. Henderson still a little above freezing at 33. In fact, really, along and south of the Ohio River is where the above freezing temperatures are, but 29 in Princeton right now, 31 in Dubois County over in Jasper. So let's kind of check the winds here for you, what to expect as we go through tomorrow. So here's tomorrow morning. These aren't gusts, by the way. These are just sustained winds around 15 to 20 miles per hour tomorrow morning with temperatures in the upper teens. That's why we have that wind chill close to uh, zero. By the afternoon, we're looking closer to 15 to 20 miles per hour. That's going to keep our wind chill still in the single digits tomorrow afternoon. Still close to 15 tomorrow evening. Maybe dying down a little bit tomorrow night, but still roughly around 10 close at times to 15. That's what's going to create that wind chill close to zero on Monday morning. We kind of die the winds down a little bit Monday afternoon, but we'll have wind chills probably close to about 15 degrees Monday afternoon. But luckily, if I can give you any good news, here it is. Live first warning Doppler and the network of Dopplers are all quiet. As you see on Storm Tracker, still a few clouds here and there with us, so we're going to have a partly cloudy sky as we go into the overnight hours. But you can see here, Future Tracker does kind of keep us partly cloudy. Skies will be a whole lot brighter tomorrow. It's not going to be wet tomorrow by any means, but again, we have the winds with us and that wind chill, so don't let old soul above your heads confuse you. That's going to be a nice day outside because you look out the window, you would think so, but it's not. It's going to be a chilly one with those partly cloudy skies. Tomorrow night, we'll have some variable clouds, a little extra cloud coverage tomorrow night, but cold tomorrow night down in the lower teens and to Monday morning fairly good amount of cloud coverage on Monday with some sunshine breaking through as we go throughout the day it's a mix of sun and clouds still below freezing though all day long as we get into Monday night that's when skies begin to clear giving us a lot of sunshine for our Tuesday which is just barely above the freezing mark so mid 20s tomorrow upper 20s tomorrow so not getting out of the freezer we are below freezing now and we are going to stay there tonight tomorrow tomorrow night Monday Monday night and for much of Tuesday until we get just barely above freezing Tuesday afternoon despite all that sunshine. Good news is rain chances are pretty slim Thursday. That's later in the day. Pretty much a rain event all day on Friday and a little bit into Saturday. But right now, looks just to be a rain. No wintry weather in forecast right now.